From the breathtakingly narrow houses rising on tiny plots of land in Tokyo to the engineering marvels punctuating New York's skyline, recent years have seen a proliferation of slender buildings. There are many reasons why we build super-thin structures, economics, limited space, and even, in the case of the Beirut Grudge House, built by a man seeking to block his brother's sea view, revenge. As the trend has gained momentum, many incredible examples of slender structures have appeared around the world, including London's Slim House, designed by Almanac, which narrows to a point of just 2.3 metres, and this 1.8 metre wide house by Ewa Architects in Tokyo, a city famed for its dense living spaces and super skinny residences. To avoid a crowded interior, Ewa focused on keeping as much free space as possible with many rooms located on split levels, reducing the need for walls. At the other end of the spectrum, the super slender towers on Manhattan's Billionaire's Row take their narrow forms to impressive heights, and the district is now home to the world's thinnest skyscraper. From the many narrow buildings around the world, we've chosen to highlight a notable few. These are either record holders, famous in their own right, or impressive in their innovative use of small spaces. From thin to thinner, breathe in and get ready to experience the world's thinnest buildings. This video was made possible by Trading212, one of the world's most popular trading apps that allows anyone to invest in thousands of real stocks and ETFs completely free, without commission, fees or limits. All of the B1M's viewers are entitled to a free share worth up to £100. Simply download the Trading212 app at the link below, open an Invest account and use the B1M promotion code. Trading212 has been downloaded more than 14 million times and has been consistently rated as the UK's number one trading app since 2016. In a country renowned for its wide open spaces, this super slender tower has become emblematic of the densification undergoing Australia's major cities. Standing as one of Melbourne's skinniest buildings, Phoenix Tower is an astounding 6.7 metres wide. For context, New York City's authorities do not allow skyscrapers to be built on plots that are less than 13 metres wide. With only one apartment per floor and with space so tight, lifts open directly into each residence. Planning requirements saw an illuminated blue ribbon added along the front and sides of the tower, so it appeared as more than just a razor-thin slab of concrete in the skyline. Located just steps from Granada's famous Alhambra is the world's thinnest hotel. With a maximum width of just 5.2 metres and a depth of 16.4 metres, the Molinos Hotel has officially been the world's narrowest since 1996. Featuring nine rooms across three floors, as well as a reception desk that doubles as a cafeteria, previously the only way to access the Alhambra was through the lobby of the hotel, making the Molinos famous worldwide. Easily mistaken as the front of the building behind it, this 1.82 metre wide structure holds the Guinness World Record for the skinniest commercial building. The original property was bought by Chang Toy in 1902 when it was a standard sized lot. However, the government decided to widen a neighbouring road in 1912, cutting into his land. After they refused to properly compensate Chang, he built a two storey building in protest. The structure is still used as an office space and holds historical significance for playing a key role in the development and heritage conservation of Vancouver's Chinatown. The narrowest house in Amsterdam, a city which has more than its fair share of slender structures, is this famous canal building. Popular with tourists, it even boasts its own Lego set. The property is the result of creative tax avoidance, as houses used to be taxed on how wide they were and how much of the canal street they took up. While in Amsterdam, we should give an honourable mention to Single 7, which is also said to be the narrowest house in the city, measuring just over a metre across its front facade. However, 
This structure opens up to a roomy 3 meters at its far end. Croatia's Church of St. Martin is thought to be the narrowest church in the world. At just 1.64 meters wide and 10 meters long, it used to be a passage for watchmen who would secure the entrance to the Diocletian Palace. At the beginning of the 9th century, it was turned into a Christian church and consecrated to St. Martin. It has since become a much visited tourist attraction. Finally, the title of World's Thinnest Building belongs to the Carrot House in Warsaw that is an astonishing 92 centimetres wide at its narrowest point and just 1.22 metres across at its widest. The house was originally created as a seemingly impossible artistic concept and presented at the Wola Art Festival in 2009. Completed in 2012, the building is meant to respond to both the past and present of Warsaw. The city's post-war history saw temporary and random development that has resulted in a chaotic urban landscape. The Carrot House is designed to fill the space between two disparate buildings. It restores existence to an otherwise unused part of the city by providing a fully functional living space. The house now serves as a temporary home for travelling writers. While not a building, this street in Reutlingen, Germany is certainly worth squeezing in. Constructed in 1727 after a great fire, it was later commissioned as a public street in 1820. Measuring just 31 centimetres across, this incredibly narrow route attracts hundreds of visitors every year, although it is advised no one actually travels down it due to the risk of becoming stuck. If you enjoyed this video and would like to get more from the definitive video channel for construction, subscribe to the B1M. This video was made possible by Trading212. All of the B1M's viewers are entitled to a free share worth up to £100. Simply download the Trading212 app at the link below, open an investor account and use the B1M promotion code.